Hello guys and welcome back to our brand new video and we're going to go through the Xbox patch notes because it's really exciting because there is so much amazing changes that they made to this game that it's just crazy. The patch notes came out yesterday. Not a lot of people know that these changes came out with the actual update that came out yesterday and yeah, yesterday uh, there was an amazing update where the Arcology update came out and with that came all these Xbox patch notes and I just think it's amazing. So the Archaeology event, added, there are three skins for your dinos, the Bronto, the Patchy Rhino and the Trike, but there's also the Dilophosaurus mask for the hat skin. That's not too important because I covered that yesterday practically. I want to go through the actual changes that will affect you in game. So there has been a fortitude rework, the threshold for being knocked out increases with fortitude increases, so it should be a lot harder to be knocked out with narco grenades which is good because that's the main way of knocking people out and it's really OP in battle. The second change with the fortitude rework is increased natural insulation from fortitude by 8% which means you're going to get a lot more value if you level up fortitude as you'll be less cold or hot depending on the circumstances which is really awesome. It's definitely something I feel like should have been in the game like a while ago because I mean fortitude is practically useless. I personally only upgrade weight health and movement and two fortitude because I don't want to get knocked out by troll guns. But other than that, this is this gives an extra reason why you should do fortitude. The tech rex spawns only five percent of rex spawns in total. They have a twenty percent higher wild level. But here is the massive news which is pff, amazing. It's meta changing. It's it's so amazing dude. The fact that they actually listened to the community is amazing. They finally nerfed tech tappy saddles. So the tech tappy saddle range is reduced by 75%. This means that you cannot get sniped by Star Wars across the map and actual PvP can happen when it's not just ready to element. Because in the past you had to have element in order to defend with or attack with tech tappies. So this should change it and it shouldn't change it for the better like a lot and in my opinion it's the best change that I've ever done. So thank you wildcard, it is amazing. They've done some performance improvements, they've fixed some holes across the map blah 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 they said that every update I've actually personally noticed some holes being fixed across the map but um, I'm sure there's more holes that I haven't seen and for some reason they've added an extra level so the max level is 131 now I don't really know why but whatever I guess that works they fixed a ascension character loss issue which is very annoying I've heard people were losing their characters so it's good they fixed that but more importantly vaults have 350 slots that is t over double the amount of slots that it used to have. It's just a classic example of our card balancing that even nerf something ridiculously or buff something ridiculously. And we get build cases here. Te tappies have been just shot up the ass and vaults have been buffed to hell. So, what do you guys think? I'm trying to test a new source of content. Tell me if you like it. So that has been the Xbox patch notes. It's one of the biggest changes in my mind for the community, the actual PvP community. So thank you for actually caring for us finally, and yes, I'm trying to do more arc related content, uh, news content, and just patch notes content. Uh, I won't do all the minor stuff like other YouTubers do, but I do want to try and do news content uh, which actually matters everyone in the community, just so everyone knows, because not a lot of people actually check this shit. So thank you guys for watching, tell me what you guys think in the comments, I actually really want your feedback to know what you guys actually want, if you don't want it. Oh, I guess I won't, but I personally do want to because it means more content for you guys. And, you know, it just brings more life into the channel, which works for both of us. So, tell me what you guys think. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.